So we're back with our creative parenting expert, Nikki Bush, this morning. And earlier we spoke about the cardinal rules or commandments every parent should be aware of when taking their kids out to shopping centers. And we're continuing that uh, conversation right now. Nikki, very, very important. We mentioned how stressful it is for parents. We've also mentioned uh, the top three rules that you've come up with. Never take your kids to the shopping centers when they're either tired, hungry, or sleepy. All right. That's, that's right. So in addition to that, we need to make sure we're always the boss. Okay. okay, and that means scenario planning because we can't actually always avoid the tired, hungry, thirsty yes. scenario because sometimes we have to shop at rush hour. Absolutely. Okay, so when we are taking our children shopping, especially at rush hour, sometimes we, what we need to do is do the plan in the car. Right, when we get to the shops, we're going to pop you in the trolley, we're going to race around whichever supermarket we are, like Grease Lightning <laughs> uh, or like Lightning McQueen. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> and when we get to the end, just before we get in the car, mommy's going to buy you a lollipop. Uh -huh. Or we're going to go for a milkshake. Or if you're doing the marathon shop around the big shopping center, yeah. what's really nice is to get your stuff done. And when mommy's finished doing her stuff or daddy's finished doing his stuff, we're going to go to the pet shop. Uh -huh. or the toy <laughs> shop. And you know what? It's a good idea to teach children to window shop without having to buy. Yeah. They love pet shops. They love window yeah, shopping. It used to be look. my children's favorite thing to mm. do, to go and spend 15 minutes looking at stuff they wanted to look at. That was the reward for being good, mm. for staying put in that trolley, for being um, patient while we get the stuff done that we need to get done. Absolutely. So you can have that little reward. It doesn't have to be buying them anything. It can be an experience. Or yeah. you know those little two or five rand rides or yes. the bubble gum machine? Yes, of course. Okay, where you say, and here's your two rand or here's your five rand, and you can go and put it in the machine and have your ride or have your bubble gum. When are we done? <laughs> when we're done, exactly. So we set the scenario, we set yeah. the boundaries. There's a beginning, there's an yeah. end and we get in the car, Look, we're all it, happy. It's all about finding ways to, to really keep them entertained. And you know, for, for myself, what I find works, you know, a lot of people think that I, I, I keep fit, you know, just to be fit and healthy, but I don't. It's actually, I keep fit for my kids because when I <laughs> go to the <laughs> shopping centers, I would load both of them into a trolley and I would speed down the lanes right. and I would run and they would laugh. And you know, the other people look at me like I'm absolutely <laughs> crazy, but they are enjoying it and I get my shopping done very, very quickly, which is amazing. So what you're doing is you're creating a memory. Yes. And that's what we need to do. We spend very little time with our children today. We have to create memories and fun wherever we are with whatever we have. If it's with the trolley, so be it with the trolley. Yeah, exactly. So listen, <laughs> what's, what's some final words of advice that you could offer our parents out there, you know, just to help <laughs> uh -huh. manage the stress when going to shopping centers? Right. More than anything, be emotionally present. If your mind is all over the show, your children will be climbing out of the trolley, climbing out of the pram, throwing tantrums on the floor because they can't have what, what they want. So be present and talk to them. Yeah. When you're having a conversation, this full-on conversation the whole way around, they know you're with them. When you're on your phone, they know you're not. Yeah, there we go. Very, very clever advice. Thank you so much, Nikki. Really appreciate it. I love your 10 commandments <laughs> for taking children to the shopping centers. You can go check it out on Nikki's uh, blog, nikkibush.com. Very easy. And what can I say? Happy shopping. Good luck. <laughs>